And there's so many just weird metabolisms and biologies out there that we're learning more and more about. Tell us more. Tell us, tell us all the other wacky, wacky ones. Yeah, so uh, so a lot of my talks I've given about weird creatures mm -hmm. uh, to make it you know easier for people to understand. I talk a lot about you know plants and animals and fungi mm -hmm. and things like that because they're very similar to us and we understand them very well. Uh, so one of my favorite ones to talk about is actually the hummingbird. Oh. Uh, hummingbirds are very beautiful creatures mm -hmm. uh, that have very crazy metabolisms. Mm. Uh, so the hummingbird. Uh, about 25% roughly of the hummingbird's muscular mass is inside mm. of its chest uh, because it needs its big chest muscles to beat its wings yes. so fast. Uh, so that, so their, their wings are beating very fast. They can fly up and down, sideways, mm -hmm. front and back. Uh, they can also fly upside down. Uh, cool. they're, they're, they're beating their wings so quickly that their hearts have to beat very, very, very fast. Ooh. Now, in order for the hummingbird to flap its wings so quickly mm -hmm. and so much, it needs to have a very large caloric intake. Now, for a, a hummingbird, they're very small birds. They're the, they're, you know, the yeah. smallest bird on the planet is a hummingbird. Mm -hmm. They're very small birds. And so for most of them, they're, they're taking in a very small number of calories each day in nectar. nectar. But if you, tra yeah. if you transition the, the number of uh, calories per unit of body weight of a hummingbird uh -huh. and compare that to a human being, mm -hmm. uh, then the hummingbird is somewhere around 77 times uh, the caloric requirement that we human beings have wow. per unit body weight, which means that if, if we humans uh, had that metabolism, we'd have to eat around 155,000 calories uh, <laughs> a day just to stay alive. Wow. Um, and so that, then that's a very large amount, uh, so mm. much so that it's, it's just beyond imagination of how much food you yes. would have to consume all day, every day. Just to, and this to, is this is just because they need to flap the wings so so they fast. They flap their wings so hard. They need way when, more and, energy. And when they're not doing that, when they're not flapping their wings super hard to to maintain uh, their bodies and to not just die because of this this bizarre caloric requirement, mm -hmm. uh, they then can basically shut themselves down. They go into a, a, a state of rest called a torpor, uh, where it's very close to death. Uh, it's very calming inside. It's almost like a hibernation that they have to go into when they're sleeping and when, when they're calm uh, because otherwise their muscles just require so much energy yeah. to move. Uh, and I find that bizarre and incredible. Bizarre.